I talked about that there wasn't a formal training program to go in as a rep, but did you do anything um, to help him prepare to take over the reins, not just him um, specifically training for him, but other transitions within the firm, other management in the firm or customers? So how did the um, that that transition handoff work, and was there any particular, you know, um, thing you could speak about a broader management from, from bringing someone in? I'll start that out. The answer was, while, while I was in charge, the answer is none. Uh, I brought Andy in and with the idea he could do what he wanted, but I would always advise him. But what became very clear was those were the exact kinds of things he was interested in. Building the firm, the administration of the firm, and particularly the hiring of people, which I didn't care much about at all. So that I was very lucky. I never really became involved in a growth program, an expansion program, because my theory was I wanted a sweet business that would make a good profit return, and that'd be enough. Andy had an entirely different look at it, and I think any kind of growth or plan for growth uh, began after Andy became the CEO. And I think you might say a word. Yeah, I, what, I mean, uh, Bruce, to your to your question. Um, because I came from two, you know, I'd, I'd worked for about 10 years at two similar sized firms to DCI. I think I had a bit of a sense of how a small firm operates and that was helpful. But, you know, did I take courses? Did I, you know, have a mentor? Did I have an executive coach? Um, you know, that was 20 something years ago. None of that stuff was, you know, well known or really existed. And so it, it was really, you know, kind of like jump into the pool and, and let's, let's swim around and see how this works. Uh, today, I participate in a lot of those things. You know, I'm part of a, a, uh, a really excellent group of other similar uh, CEOs of similar sized firms. And we meet twice a year. And that's like a really good source. I read a lot. You know, there are lots of different things I do to, to try to keep up on things. But at the time, there really was uh, no formal training going on.